morning. And now in the spotlight, we bring you a party with a purpose. Yeah, the annual Cortez Village Fish Festival will raise money for adjacent land preservation. Our Linda Carson has a preview. Once a year, Cortez Village throws open its doors and invites the public in to get to know their village. This is really an important treasure in the state of Florida, and we're one of the only working fishing villages left. The festival is sponsored by the Florida Institute of Saltwater Heritage, or FISH for short. It supports FISH, which was put together in 1992. We purchased preserved property over here in 1999, and the festival has gone to support and pay for that property. So far, they've purchased 96 acres. They say it's the only undeveloped property on Sarasota Bay. The festival is a huge celebration. The festival is full of food, great entertainment from country to jazz to blues. We try to have entertainment that everybody will enjoy. We have 60 artists and it's nothing manufactured. It's all handmade artwork. They're selected to be part of our festival. There'll be a great kids area and the museum will be open. Everybody can go and visit and learn about uh, the maritime fishing industry around here, as well as our cultural center, which will teach you about the families that in the 18, late 1800s came and actually settled this village in 1883. There'll be demonstrations showing you what life is like in the fishing village. This is really a piece of old Florida, and you don't find it, it's like a hidden treasure. And the people are mighty, this little village is mighty. It's mighty and strong, and it has uh, endured a lot, and it's just trying to preserve what's important to them. The festival will give you a great day beside the bay, and the fun raised at the festival will help preserve the ecosystem around Cortez for many, many generations to come. So take a step back in time and come to the Cortez Fishing Festival this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, in Cortez Village. Linda Carson, ABC7, your Suncoast News.